Hey everybody, Alex Camilio here, CEO of the Agent Inner Circle with AgentInnerCircle.com and this week we want to talk to you about building those email lists. Now that being said, in my career I've built lists of 50 and 60,000 people before, so I know a thing or two about how to get people to opt in to giving their email addresses up to you. Now that being said, I'm sure if you're in the real estate world at all, you have heard leads, leads, leads for the last, gosh, long time now, right? But, th but there are some proven methods that have been used over the years to drastically build email lists. And we're actually going to do a two part article about this. And in this week's article, we're going to cover some of the free and inexpensive ways that you can get more emails onto that list of yours. And then in next week, we're going to talk about how you can leverage your existing contacts as well as if you want to actually go spend some budget money on this, some ways that you really can draw people into your email list in general. All right. So the article this week covers a lot more of this in depth, but we're going to dive on in. And one thing I want to talk to you about is before any of this starts, you need to have some piece of value, whether that's an educational flyer, a how to video, a report that you're putting together, whatever it might be, you need some piece of content because it's a little thing called reciprocity, right? For someone to feel like they want to give up their email list to you, you need to give them something of value to do so. We give some great examples in the article. I'd check it out over there. Uh, but like I said, educational flyer, a newsletter, there are so many things that you can offer people to sign up for. And we give some information in the article. Now, once you have that piece of value, you can go everywhere with it. You can ask people all over the place to opt into your list using this piece of value. Now, what are some of the places that you can do that? Now, one of which that we talk about all the time that it's funny how it gets tossed over is to call your contacts. I know it's a simple one. I had to pause for a minute there. Call your contacts. The reason for this is a lot of people don't think about it. They have a full list of their friends, their family, all of that, but they don't actually call those people to get their emails, right? Get their emails, put them on the list and start them on those drip campaigns. So in this week's article, we'll give you a quick script that you can use to easily call your contacts to build your email list. From there, you can add these sort of opt-ins to your email signature. We give you some text to do so. You can use opt-in forms on your website. You can even use event sign-up sheets. If you're going out, you're doing open houses, you're doing um, you know, buyer events for first-time buyers, things like that. Always make sure to be signing them up and getting their email addresses at the door, okay? Those are all free, free, free methods that we've given you right there. Easy things that you can use to go get more emails in your list. Now, let's say we wanna go into some inexpensive methods. Now we could dive into Facebook advertising. There's a huge piece we can do about that, except we've already done one in recent past. So we're going to link you over there in the article, as well as Anthony Mann um, a, of a social strategy is going to be coming in and doing a bunch of content monthly on social media for us. So we'll let him give us the inside tips and tricks on Facebook ads, which he's already done and going to continue doing. You can also include things on your business cards or your postcards if you're spending a little bit of money, right? So inexpensive, inexpensive methods, but methods that you're probably going to use in your business anyway, right? So business cards, postcards, Facebook ads, all of these are inexpensive methods you can use to build your email list. This all might sound simple, but a lot of times it's that you're not hitting all of these. You've only targeted maybe one or two tops and you're going after those make sure you are hitting all avenues possible to build those email lists because they they truly can be the lifeblood of your business thank you so much this has been alex camelio ceo of the agent inner circle with agentinnercircle.com i urge you to go over and check out the article there is an immense amount of value over there for you to for you to use um, and that being said give us a share give us a like follow our group check out our page thank you again Hope you have a wonderful day. This is Alex Camilio, Agent Inner Circle, signing out.